can we do about lowering the cost of daycare? Hayden, obviously a working family, and it's very hard for working families to get by. How will we lower the cost of daycare? You know, such an important question, Charlie. And I think one of the things that we can do is make it easier for family models to choose or for families to choose whatever model they want, right? So one of the ways that you might be able to relieve a little bit of pressure on people who are, who are paying so much for daycare is make it so that, that you know, maybe like grandma or grandpa wants to help out a little bit more, or maybe there's an aunt or uncle that wants to help out a little bit more. If that happens, you relieve some of the pressure on all the resources that we're spending in daycare. Now, you talk about just daycare. Let's say you don't have somebody who, who can provide that extra set of hands. What we've got to do is actually empower people to get trained in the skills that they need for the 21st century. We've got a lot of people who love kids, who would love to take care of kids, but they can't either because they don't have access to the education that they need, or maybe more importantly, because the, the state government says you're not allowed to take care of children unless you have some ridiculous certification that has nothing to do, nothing to do with taking care of kids. So empower people to get the skills they need. Don't force every early child care specialist to go and get a six-year college degree where they've got a whole lot of debt and Americans are much poorer because they're paying out the, the, the wazoo for daycare. Empower working families, empower people who want to do these things for a living, and that's what we got to do. All right. We